Hello everybody, welcome to the fourth quarter final. This is gonna be a replay because it happened at the same time as Dimi versus Artemis. And uh, you can see there at the draw, Dimi plays Court Guy in one of the semi-finals and Will King awaits the winner of this match. And uh, Dimi's in the booth, hello Dimi. Hello everybody, good evening, good morning, good afternoon. <laughs> Happy birthday. And, Happy uh, birthday everybody. And uh, yeah, we've got Talk, talk, talk. So his semi-finals versus Will King's Lizards, if he wins. So this he's getting practice at the same time, but it's a tough matchup, isn't it, Lizards, for anybody? Um, I'm, I'm, I won't be as aware of the matchup as you, Dimi. Of course, you're the knob expert on this channel, but uh, yeah, it's interesting. It's, build. it's a nightmare for both of them, honestly. Like this is a very dicey one. Like because the thing is, right, knobs just can't do anything, <laughs> but they can just stand up, and that can be enough in this matchup. <laughs> yeah. But like, it's yeah. so weird. Because, like, as long as they don't die, like, it can really frustrate the lizards. But, yeah. like, the, but they can't do anything, you know what I mean? They can't, like, move <laughs> around. They can't really hit anything. <laughs> but if they don't die and they keep standing up, then the lizards just don't get anywhere. So it's a bit of a weird one, yeah. There we go, then. So the lizards won the toss, chose to receive. And he's, he's fielding the skink, the chameleon skink for the whole half. He has 12 players, only two rerolls. Uh, which I like this, for overtime format. This is the classic uh, Blood Bowl matchup where either I'm knobs or lizards, I'm unhappy with the matchup. <laughs> mm. <laughs> but probably more unhappy as knobs. Yeah, I'd be happy if I was lizards because I've got lizards instead of knobs. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, I, I, I would be, you know, just massively confident. If I was the lizards here, I'd be like, they're knobs, they can't do anything easy victory um, but I tend to think that about every game as Lizards because Lizards are insane right There's, it's only so good. They're yeah. so good. like Wood, wood Elves and Dark Elves are like the tricky ones uh, and I guess Pro Elves as well if anybody ever used them or High Elves but I mean don't exist on Blood Bowl 3 so like Elves are really the only thing that's got a bit of danger everything else you kind of feel like you should stomp them I think yeah so you like this turn like what's he blitzing uh, I don't know <laughs> Like, I guess you could put two guards in and blitz the rookie Saurus, but, like, it's just not worth it, really. Like, you just... Oh, he's going to go for the one on the outside. The only problem with this is it stretches your line, like, so... Yeah, he's going to blitz with a tackle. Oh, okay, this is all right. Yeah, it's all right. But it's like one bodyguard, like... Slightly... Too weird. There's a gaping he... hole if he, if he blitzes the, uh... Olga. Yeah. But doesn't I mean, choose to go through it. I don't think he needs it. Like, it's turn two, man, and he's losing. Like, he has got it on a move by Skink for some reason. But, <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, when he moved them in, I thought he was going to blitz the Olga. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, I know what you mean. He doesn't have to get through. But the thing is, it's, you know, the, this is the thing, right? Like, one of the things, one of the reasons why I'm not bothered too much against knobs is when I get the chance, I go through because they aren't easy to get through, right? So yeah. if if you don't go through them when you can go through them, then you will get stuck on them and that. Like, so yeah, you've got to be aware that they can get in your fucking way with stand firm and fend. So if you get the chance to just smash through them early on turn two, you might as well go for it a lot of the time, I think. Yeah, these guys just gave up the hit. Yeah, he's just going to put Wall of Guard in. Like, if, if you're Lizards, you probably just want to be smashing the AV8 line on his feet again. Yeah. Oh, walk down. No mighty blow from either side. Oh. I mean, this is still fine though, right? It's, if he powers the bodyguard and then blitz the other guy, it's still a spring. Ish. What happened there? Oh, he wrestled him. Wrestled him on there. Yeah, the wrestle's annoying, isn't it, for Lizards? Because you're losing, you're losing a strength four player. Yeah, yeah. But the thing is, is, is like, so this is the thing. Like, knobs on defense, nightmare for Lizards. Lo knobs on offense, it's going to be hilarious how crap they are. Because they're going to be struggling to get a two dice, and half the time they're going to be putting themselves on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's a it's a weird old 
Like the knob offense is tricky. That's the that's the bit of mastering knobs is making sure you score. The old knob off. Yeah. There we go. Three three hits on Soros this turn. Well, right, Crocs so. and two Soros. Yeah. Yeah, Using the wall of guard. He's completely uh, momentum shifted here, isn't he? So it's yeah. all just knob momentum now. Yeah. Although he's got like a nice turn just to stand everything up here, like nothing's based, so he can have a reset. I'd blitz that knob on the right with mm. the wrestle. Yeah, but I mean, turn four resetting on offense isn't great, is it? Do you know what I mean? Like, you're not in the opponent's yeah, yeah. path, but I guess he doesn't have to get too deep. He doesn't need too much penetration versus knobs. He needs he needs three squares, like. Into the half right. Four, four squares. Four squares. Oh, because he's got the bloody camo skin. Yeah. Yeah, I really don't like the camo skin. No, I don't. Just oh, he's not. Right. Wait, is there this? Ah, the other skin's going across. Here. Okay. Oh, what? So, the Saurus. The <laughs> oh, Saurus. I'm watching the stream. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, instant dub skulls. Oh, like. Right. Double skulls into Olga Bonehead. Nice. Oh, that's brutal. But all the all the uh, all the guard is really nice, isn't it? Here, lots and lots of guard. Yeah. I think it's the stand. But well, obviously the guard, like, because he's got so many and they're all jammed together. But like the stand fan is also. Horrendous for visits. It's one of the four. Do you know what I forgot to put the things on. Oh, he's only got four guard. Oh, like five. He's it was, the guard, it was the guard. Over, yeah. The Crocs has got a guard. That's what I was thinking. That was a. He had like a throw with guard or something, but it's the Crocs has guard rather than that old block lizards. No, I didn't get the follow-up yet. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's a big... He loaded it. He loaded it. Oh, wow. Okay. Turn okay. five panic, innit? I mean... <coughs> yeah, there's no reason to panic. Like, just yet. It's like lizards. No, I don't think he should have. Yeah. Oh. I, I have to tell myself, like, every turn with lizards... I don't need to do anything. Like, just don't do anything. Oh my god, this isn't safe, is it? I guess it's kind of safe. Yeah, don't panic, don't panic. <laughs> yeah, it's just literally like, oh. I uh, See, look, now he can just wrap around the side with skinks. So, like, he's he's got the breakthrough here, and it's perfect. Whoa, it's not safe. Look, he chained him in. He chained him in. Ooh. Gets the full power. Has he got recovery, though? It doesn't need it, does he? Like, just banging it down is good enough. I don't know. Like, oh. he can, he can free that skink. He needs to pick up on the skink on the far right. He's got this bludger as well. So, yeah, yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. That's nice. Him from behind. But, yeah, I think... <laughs> yeah, that power there is huge. He shouldn't yeah. pick it up on the camo. He should... He should Dodge out the. Uh, right, not dodge out, right? Just punch out. Oh, has he got the blitz? Pun no, he's, this guy's basing him, so he's punching. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, like, you want to get up that sideline now. Like, this is the turn you want to get up the sideline, because it's. There's, like, all the knobs are kind of out of place. Yeah. But I mean, didn't he dodge the skink? That's what I'm saying. Oh, I was talking about the one on the bludger. Ah, right. Yeah, yeah. He was. Yeah, yeah. I was. I was thinking, pick up all the ball on him, and then use the other ones to go forward and screen it and stuff. But... Right. Oh, he hasn't gone far enough. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> he was just <laughs> making sure he wasn't dead. <laughs> uh. Yeah, double GFI yeah, for two. Yeah. I was gonna say, yeah, the, the skink that's on the right of the ball carrier could have just been one GFI and made that save. Mm. Well, Again, this might, ball. might be a trap sack. Could be, yeah, he's only got one reroll left. Smashing a skink and tackle. All so he's got from sack of the ball was gave the ball to a better skink. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 
I was not up for running. Uh, yeah, no. I wouldn't even. Ooh. Oh, I wish it was one square forward and he went on the trap. <laughs> <laughs> See what happens. They're actually, funnily enough, they're actually quite good, aren't they, having knobs here because they can't get pushed into the trap and they, they could, like, you know, get stuck and push other people into the uh, sack. But uh, to answer to answer chat there, how do you work out what kind of serious injury it is? First of all, this is resurrection, so the, the injuries don't stick. But, and neither does the UI. It, it affects the apple, though. That's yeah, it affects the apple, yeah. But... So, like, one to six is badly hurt, and then... Was it seven, eight, nine? There, you can hover it there, right? And it. Uh, I've got a mod. I've got a mod that tells you that. Actually, it actually doesn't tell you that anymore. <laughs> oh, it it tells you what the injury is. Yeah, I've got a mod to tell me. <laughs> yeah, I hate that. Like, yeah, seriously injured. And it's like, yeah, all right. Well, what's this serious injury? <laughs> it's just a niggle, isn't it? Serious injury. Um. Oh, we free three in it. Free three, two, two. I just failed the first one, so we're not doing oh, anything, we're just getting smashed. Yeah, I think I see dice on the ball. You can even hit it into the tackle guy as well. <laughs> I think I see dice on the ball. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, Dim. <laughs> yeah. 3D on the ball with tackle. Yeah, but the problem with 3D, who's going to get... Oh, he's going to dodge the blodger out. Ooh. Oh, that's a and he doesn't, Do you know need, what? he like, doesn't need recovery, right? It's turn seven. Uh, what, the knob? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, this guy needs to be a scoring threat. Yeah, least. scoring threat. Yeah, scoring threat, not recovery, yeah. Yeah, sorry. But, like, the, the whole thing in my head with the art game was just like, I just don't really want it to go to overtime. <laughs> So I wasn't that bothered if he scored. <laughs> I was just like, <laughs> I was like oh, ball, blood ball. yeah, yeah. I was like, if he scores on like my drive and then scores again, I'll, at least I don't have to play overtime. And then when he gave me a little bit of a chance, I was like, if I score, I don't have to play overtime. <laughs> and I got the perfect result, and yet to play twelve turns. Yeah. Really, art doing the Lord's work for everybody, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> The new art strike of getting diced into concession is working brilliant for his opponents. They, oh. they play less football. Oh. Big Kaz. What's he got? Is he got any skinks? Oh no, his skinks are marking the score. Track. All of his skinks got knocked over, so yeah, he couldn't uh, score. Double scold. So what's he got? He's ca oh, Kaz the tackle. Kaz the tackle, yeah, that's a brutal yeah, one, isn't it? Really nice, really nice. Uh, and I think. I think. He's done enough to stop the score. Oh wow, huge foul. There's a chance this, this guy can go 3 GFI, GFI, lob it. He's got catch, so it's not even that bad. Okay, so no, he's gonna, gonna he's gonna dodge the other guy, isn't he? He's just gonna go. Oh yeah, this oh, guy, no. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Oh, he's just dodging for the extra movement. Oh. GFI's to there, makes it a 3 plus pass and oh. fails. Oh, I made, I made my first uh, Imperial Nobility pass completion on uh, the weekend gym. Oh, well done. Yeah, yeah. With a throw off, with a throw off. Mm. I, I took a throw off, even though I didn't hate him. I didn't use running pass though, sadly. Thanks. I was hoping to use running past at some point. <laughs> it just <laughs> doesn't come up. <laughs> it just doesn't. Ooh, Blitz. Blitz. Ooh. Uh, not sure on the base game function. I, I can because I have the mod, but I don't know without it. What's that? Caution. In game BB3. I'm just not sure, honestly. Oh, what stat you get, isn't it? I don't know. Yeah. Maybe I don't have the mod actually. No, maybe it does tell you. No, well, now that I think about it, maybe I don't. Because uh, I think it changed the icons to be like minus AG and stuff. Yeah, it's and been now, like, so, like broken arm is like passing fast, isn't it? Mm. And like, there, there's certain like 
specific like neck injury is AV bust or something like that. I can't remember. Yeah, uh, no, actually, I think oh. it does tell you. I think I think I don't use the mod anymore, so I think it just tells you. Yeah, I think it just tells you. Now that I think about it, I think I don't use the mod. The blitz didn't work. I'll be honest, I wasn't looking at the blitz. The the lizard's got a blitz and based everybody up. I wasn't really looking. Wasn't paying attention. Yeah, but this is where it gets really miserable for knobs. It's just like they're gonna be. Well, I mean, he has killed a saurus, so that kind of makes it slightly less miserable. Yeah, he's cast a saurus, and he's you know he's uh... knocked everything over. And he's gonna foul this as well. One D pal. Oh, disgusting that is. <laughs> and another one D pal. Oh my god. He rolled one at the end of the last game as well. At uh, the <laughs> end of the last half. So he's got he's got a Saurus cast and every every other Saurus knocked over that turn. But he does get the skink pack through here maybe. He's got no tackle to deal with him. He's just blitz in the line. Eh? Instant removal. Is AV8? Nope. No. No. Comedy mega. Oh. So. Yeah, this is a bit tricky, isn't it? But it does have a few players over here, so. Not terrible. Yeah. That's <laughs> wrestled. a problem. Yeah, that's a problem. But it wasn't wrestled. He didn't wrestle. Yeah, the lizard didn't wrestle. Oh, what well, you mean the knob player didn't wrestle? The knobs, the knobs got wrestled. He didn't wrestle. Oh, he must have must have been a misfit then. Yeah, I guess it was. Or unless he just figured, oh, it's the end of my turn and I might kill a skink. I don't know. That's, I, I can imagine it's a misclick, but I don't know. Mm, that's pretty wild. Having made several misclicks <laughs> myself, I, uh, <laughs> I can relate to that one. Oh, Fend is OP, Jimmy. Oh, <laughs> got it. <laughs> Both down. <laughs> <laughs> no, where are you going? Don't go there. Oh, God, no. <laughs> oh, God, no. Yes, this offense is looking brutal already. Punch the guard. <sighs> not punch the you guard again. do not. Punch the guard again. Ow. Mate, that's the so that's the annoying thing about having guard on the bodyguards is that whenever you're all based up, they have to punch your bodyguard because he's the one with the guard. <laughs> yeah. And then he dies. <laughs> like <laughs> So annoying. It's funny that like this went from all of the Sauras down to all of the Sauras up, like in it one turn later. That's wild. Yeah, I don't know what he's going to do here. He's not surfing. Oh, he's blitzing out. Where's the ball going? Through the gap. And... Oh, Kaz is a skink. That helps. Staying there. Oh, big overpower that one. Huge overpower. Can free a Saurus though. Oh no, it's a one D. I guess he can put the chameleon in and then two D the guard. No, not there. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, it did the job, but yeah, it was a bit yeah. risky. Oh my god. Shouldn't have rolled up skulls. That was a big mistake. <laughs> Huge mistake. He needs to try and work a way to free a Saurus. Is what he needs to do. Yeah. That's all I should have blitzed the front as well. Oh, you don't oh reroll that, God. you should not have rerolled that. Like it sucked. It sucked, but you gotta use you gotta keep your last reroll. Gotta remain disciplined. Problem is he's blitzed him free and he's just gonna get instantly tagged. Why are you, why are you <laughs> stuck you on a car? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Got him free so he can be stuck on another player. I mean it's still like as well as it's going for knobs, it's still... <laughs> yeah, like, it's still awful. tenuous, isn't it? Like, uh... mm. Oh, yeah, just blitz this guy who gave me two assists on him. Thank you. Yeah, 
Oh, he's not fouling. Mm. Might have been tempted to chuck a foul. Oh, guard doesn't assist foul. Yeah. Like mm. uh. Oh, yeah. Very good go on, Joe. Yeah, do you know what? I, I, I did have a mod, but I, I think I uninstalled it. I had two mods and I think I installed them both when I was doing the, you know, last last year, the uh, Season 2 Finals. I thought I'd better use the base game so that I know what's going oh. on. Eats the dub skulls. That was a good dub skulls eat. Yeah, I mean, he's got three rerolls and uh, lizards have none. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't an eat, was it? He had no choice, but that was... <laughs> wasn't that bad. <laughs> oh, that was the Lizards of Dub Skull. Yeah. Mate, that's, that's his like, third Dub Skull in two turns as well. Yeah, it's not been great, has it? It's that's turn 13 the, now. It's not the sort of performance that will get you through to a semi-final of the NAF Cup, Jimmy. <laughs> no. You can say that again, Dimmy. Oh my yeah. god, this ogre has just been stupid every single turn. This <laughs> half has been terrible. He punched, he punched the Saurus, then it's just been useless. Oh, why just... Did he need to stand him for two dice? He didn't need no. to stand him for two dice, did he? He should have just took the hit and then freed the Saurus. Yep. Yeah, you can do this a bit, uh... I think he just scores next turn, right? Talk, 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 talk. Yeah, especially this is no rerolls, mate. I hope they just don't pick it up. Yeah, just get it done. Honestly, knobs are like vampires in the sense that they just don't want to have to defend the ball. Like, but they're very unlike vampires. <laughs> it's not because they're like amazing on defense. It's just because they're really shit on offense. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, they're pretty good when they cast every skink they block. Yeah, it's, I, think it would, I think this is... He might not even need to score now, to be honest with you. No. 3Ds him. I think they're pretty good here. It, he hasn't activated the Ogre yet. Like, I would have liked to have seen if the Ogre moved. Before. Yeah. Yeah, because... If the Ogre didn't move there, then he could have freed a Saurus. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. He would have been in range to hit him as well. Yeah, I mean, if he didn't activate the ogre, he would have. Uh, he'd have put the guard that side, wouldn't he? But yeah, that was uh, super interesting. Oh, mate, when you don't pound off. <laughs> it, like I like that's where I think that's where my love and love comes from. It's the glint in my opponent's <laughs> eye dying as they don't roll a pal. But like. Unfortunately, this weekend they rolled too many pounds. <laughs> yeah, just when they're like, you, you know, if they have like two turns back to back where it's just push both down, push both down, and they're either going on the floor or just. <laughs> yeah. They're like, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> uh, yeah. That's when that's when I'm in my element, Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> Beats him off. Just got to go to the other side now, right? Just yeah, it's fine. He's got, he can even put a screen up as well. Yeah. See, so probably shouldn't be next to the sideline just in case he uphill double powers him. Oh, he's <laughs> putting him, and then it and then it goes into the crowd, right? I mean, yes, yes. Uh, if he's I guess this back. stops him getting around the other side, though, right? If he was one up, then one skin could go that side and one skin oh, could and go tag this side. Yeah. It's still going to be uphill either way, though, right? Yeah, but it just like you know, like it would mean he would still you still have to make a block on his turn instead of just scoring. Maybe I don't know. Maybe, maybe he thought it's like one in thirty-six, though. Isn't it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think you need to worry about getting fouled. So there you go. Talk, talk, talk. Um, absolute domination every time he hit a skink. He obviously he read he read Reddit, didn't he? And uh, and he just enacted the Reddit plan of just every time you hit a skink, he has it and he's lost four skinks. Yeah, this is incredible. <laughs> <laughs> and it rains. Well. Games versus lizards do get easier when you cas every single skink that you touch. To be honest. <laughs> 
I to can. Be fair, uh, yeah, as much as it's annoying not powering guard and stand firm, like it's even more annoying when you power skink and they don't die. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and it's it's annoying as the skinks when every single time you get powered, you get killed. Like it was crazy. Like nearly every time he hit one, he cast it. It was pretty brutal. So I've got some sympathy. Was that that was the quarter final though, wasn't it? It so was a quarter final, yeah. Yeah, well done for uh, getting them. Um... Yeah. Exciting. And uh, congratulations, talk, talk, talk. Who will be facing Will King in the second semi-final? If you bear with yeah. me, I'll. Uh... That's another. That's another lizard matchup, isn't it? So it is. Yeah. Yeah. I think both of them are pretty good coaches as well, so like, it'll, that's going to be a hard matchup for both of them, I think. Yeah, so there you go, there's the there's the draw, we've got Dimmy versus Cork Guy, Cork Guy's got Orcs, Dimmy's got Undead, Will King with Lizards versus Talk 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 with Knobs. There you go, very exciting. Super and, uh, exciting. Super exciting, yep, those games will take place next week. Thank you very much, Dimmy. Um, amazing having you here in the booth. The champ himself. Champ, champ, champ. And thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.